Hi, good morning. I'm, oh, good evening, I guess, at this time. Uh, the, I'm uh, Senator Clarence Nishihara. I represent Pearl City, Waipahu, and Palisades in Waipahu. I'm in Pearl City. Um, that's the 17th uh, Senatorial District. Uh, I'm in room 204, and I invite people to come down to look at this particular piece that's sitting off to my right. It's called the three not so little pigs and the not so um, little bad wolf. Anyway, it's an interesting piece, uh, set of pieces. They're all uh, individually made. Uh, three large uh, porcines with the one little wolf. And it's uh, work done by Jackie uh, Mild Lau. And there's a a story behind it. Uh, what the pigs represent are the three um, major, I would assume, uh, uh, large countries that did not sign on to the Kyoto Agreement. And uh, that's J China, India, and the United States. And the little, uh, not, uh, the little uh, wolf at the bottom uh, next to it is, um, represents con their, uh, the conscience. So it's a little nagging of the conscience against these huge uh, uh, pigs that uh, uh, look more like they're uh, hardly intimidated by the little wolf. And so I think it's, it's, a, it's like a, a, a representative of, uh, of a statement that the artist wanted to make, which I found uh, quite interesting because when you look at it, you say, wow, they're really you know, nicely uh, gestured pigs. And you think, wow, then maybe that's all there is to it. But, this is not the Little Red Riding Hood story or the Three Little Pigs story or any of those. It has a, um, a geopolitical uh, piece to it. And so, you know, I think these are well worth coming to look at. I think uh, anyone who comes by to look at it could appreciate the pieces as they are. Uh, the expressions on the pigs are quite, quite interesting. And um, I think you'd come away with a, a different slant about uh, some of these uh, stories of uh, what made children's stories, but how it, they have new meaning as is created within the artist's perception and recreation. So I think it's worth it. People coming down to room 204, I encourage you to come and I think you'll be quite pleased. Thank you. Aloha, I'm Jonathan Johnson, Executive Director of the State Foundation on Culture and the Arts. The art you just saw is from the Art in Public Places collection. By placing works of art, in publicly accessible state buildings, we advance the concept of a museum without walls, making art accessible to everyone. Be sure to come to Art of the Capitol Friday, March 6th at 4.30.